Hey, what's up? This is Thinking Out Loud with your man, Ben Scorrell. How you doing? What's up, what's up, what's up? Hey, I'm looking at this article right here. Atlanta rapper offers 10K reward and woman shooting death. All right, all right, all right. We're going to see what this is. Let me see. DeKalb County, Georgia, a metro Atlanta family is desperately seeking answers in the shooting death of a 25-year-old woman, police say, was killed in DeKalb County apartment complex over the weekend. While police are still searching for the person responsible, loved ones of Tamea Parker are offering a $10,000 reward for information that gets them closer to those answers. I wouldn't wish this on no other mother. Her mother, Courtney Parker, told news sources on Monday for Parker and the rest of her family, this Memorial Day weekend was an especially difficult one to get through, knowing her daughter's killer is still out there. You know. When you're home, get, we're going to get to that. According to DeKalb County, the 25-year-old was one of the two people shot at an apartment complex on Wall Drop Trail late Friday night an incident they believe may have been drug-related. Woman dead, and now her family's desperate for answers. As Fox Eyes Joy Dukes reports, the family is offering a reward of their own, hoping that someone will come forward. My loved ones of the 25-year-old victim tell me they are devastated by this sudden loss and they are struggling to comprehend why this happened. Now, while police are looking for the person responsible, they're now offering a $10,000 reward for those answers. I don't want wish this pain on no mother. For Courtney Parker and her family. I just can't believe it. It's unreal to me. It's so unreal. This Memorial Day weekend was an especially difficult one to get through knowing her daughter's killer is still out there. Okay, today is a holiday, but meanwhile, while their family celebrating the holiday, we're, and we're grieving. DeKalb County police say 25-year-old Jemiah Parker was one of two people shot inside this apartment complex on Waldrop Trail late Friday night, an incident they believe may have been drug-related. thought it was murder. I'm not sure why. What happened on none of that? We're not familiar with these apartments. We don't live nowhere around here. Two residents tell Fox 5 they heard the gunshots and came to her aid before EMS arrived. I saw her laying on the ground out the car and the other um, gentleman was administering chest compression. Started resuscitating her and kept telling her that she needs to live, stay awake, and then uh, until the paramedics came. Parker was later pronounced dead at the hospital. Loved ones described her as a good person. They say she worked at Amazon and would do anything for her family, which includes Atlanta rapper Amaretta. Jemiah was a very loving, humble, honest, hardworking young woman, and she really didn't deserve this. After holding a balloon release Sunday, family members gathered Monday at the place where she took her last breaths in hopes it would lead to more information. She was shot multiple times. It's just, we need answers. Answers they're now offering a $10,000 reward for. They say it's the only way they'll get closure. There's no word on funeral arrangements at this time. We reached out to DeKalb County Police for an update on the investigation. You heard it. Well, there's so many, how many times we be hearing the same old story and stuff. Like, we get this all of the time. Uh, the rapper name, I forgot what rapper they just said offering 10k it's supposed to be that uh county offering that right it's supposed to be the county offering the 10k reward and stuff you know right of, so it should have been double twenty thousand. it should have been 20k straight up you know if somebody if another entity is offering an award the the the, the police department the sheriff department is supposed to match up with that but I guess the sheriff department don't care, huh? So they had a hard uh, Memorial Day weekend. Uh, what was that? A 25-year-old one was one of the two shot, two people shot at an, apart at an apartment complex at Wall Drop Trail late night Friday. Yeah, 
while their family is celebrating the holiday. We're hurting, we're grieving, Parker said. My daughter was murdered. I'm not sure why, what happened, or none of that. We are not familiar with these apartments. We don't live nowhere around here. That's what she said on the video. After holding the balloons released Sunday, family members gathered Monday at the place where she took her last breath in hopes it would lead to more information. I just can't believe it. It's unreal to me. It's so unreal. The victim, Aunt Yolanda Parker, said, and here you go, uh, see a picture of them. She was shot multiple times and just, we need answers. Damn. Why the hell she was shot so many times? Like, God damn, what the hell going on? Um, two residents told news sources they heard the gunshots from inside their apartments and came to Parker's aid before EMS arrived. I saw her laying on the ground out of the car, and the other gentleman was administering chest compressions. One resident recalled, I started necessitating her, telling her that she needs to live, stay awake until the paramedics came. Residents, Alexandra Lazar said, yeah, you got to make sure when somebody gets stabbed or shot or anything like that, like the best thing to do is don't even tell them that they got shot or anything like that. So they'll be like, yeah, you okay, you just fell. You got a lot to them. I'm being real, I'm an ex-military person, man. I've been in war, I've been in theater. I've seen a lot of death. So I'm telling you straight up, for if you ever be in those um, crazy circumstances, make sure you tell the person, don't tell the person they got shot or their leg is broken. Don't say nothing, just tell them, you okay, you all right, you okay. Everything is cool. Be calm. Just got to get you up out of here, man. We got to get up out of here because it's fucked up over here. You know what I'm saying? Everything is straight. Don't tell them that they get shot because they're going to go into shock. They're going to go into, um, what's the um, word? There's a term for it in the medical field. Uh, they're going to go into like a shock and then it might lead into cardiac arrest. Because it's gonna, they're gonna, it's gonna fuck with their head. So you don't, you do not tell them that they got shot. Don't tell them that their guts are hanging out. Don't tell them nothing. Don't even let them see it. You keep their head on. You keep their eyes on you, and you keep them calm. That will keep them alive. I promise you. I'm not telling you no lies. This is Ben Spurrell. We're thinking out loud. I keeps it a hundred, a hundo with all of my listeners. Real shit. Let's go. Uh, Parker was later pronounced dead at the hospital. Loved ones described her as a kind, loyal, and an all-around good person. They say she worked at Amazon and would do anything for her family, which includes Atlanta rapper Amaretta. I heard of Amaretta, but I'm not too. I think Amaretta's in this picture right here somewhere. But I heard her from, like, Love and Hip Hop, but I'm not familiar with her. Uh, Jamea was a very loving, humble, honest, hardworking young lady, and she really didn't deserve this. Family members, uh, Akila W. said, of the 25-year-old, they said, they said in offering the $10,000 reward, they're hoping they will get them closer to finding closure. I beg you to please help me find justice for my daughter, Parker said, and to plead to the community. There's no word on funeral arrangements at this time. Uh, new sources reached out to DeKalb County Police for an update on the investigation, but did not hear back as of late Monday. Man, if they offering 10000 that's because Amaretta probably got some um, people on payroll to come look for the people who did it. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, I would do that if somebody... Did that to my people's and shit. I was like, man, thirty thousand dollar reward, man. You better give me some information right now, bro. Nah, fuck that. We finna have closure today. You know what I'm saying? The more rich I am, the more the the bigger the bounty. That's just how it's gonna be. You gonna learn today, not to mess around. That's why I'm trying to structure. I'm trying to put structure in my black community because I want everybody to have money. You see what I'm saying? It's very easy to have money. You could go on YouTube and get money. You know what I'm saying? It's slow for me right now because I work and I got to do this. So I really barely have time to sleep. But fuck sleep. I can sleep when I'm dead. You did. So 
you know, these are the same similar stories that we have every time, every doggone time. So this is Ben Scarrell, your man for thinking out loud. Subscribe to this YouTube channel, Box Benji. Go to the Instagram, Box Benji, underscore murder MB at TikTok. Holla at your boy. Have a great day. One love.